So banding people together, um, as dramatic as this might sound, is really a, a chance for me to correct my leadership and collaborative wrongs. I played in a lot of bands and, you know, I, I was so quick to blame everybody else in the bands that I was playing with in terms of the lack of collaboration and the brutal truth is it wasn't really them, it was me and that was the leadership error that I made and my hope with banding people together is that I can help others avoid those, those mistakes that I made and, and not, you know, just so, so their band doesn't turn into a solo project. There's so many ways in learning that we look for new opportunities to kind of pierce the armor and create an environment where, where new learning can really happen. And we've all done the ropes courses, the trust falls. But as adults, what we haven't done is written songs. And so what's fascinating is when you drop people into this environment where it doesn't matter if you're the CEO or it's your first day on the job as a manager, you're on equal footing because you've never experienced anything like this before. And so the learning opportunity that that creates is extremely unique. I think learning, I think the most surprising thing for learning and development people is actually how effective our methodology is. I mean, we, we call it the Jedi mind trick. This is, it's fun. It, it's fun and it's engaging. And I think we've gotten to a place where we think, well, something this fun and engaging can't really yield the behavior change that we're all seeking, but we're, we're able to do it and we're very proud of it. So I love when we first let people know they're here to actually write a song. You see their body language change right there in the crowd. But once we get in the workshop, it's really cool to see the guys who came with their arms folded open up, or the ladies open up and really start giving input. All kinds of ideas start popping out and we really train people to figure out how to let the defensiveness or the anal, uh, analysis go and just become creative. So it's a great environment for that. We set ground rules as well to facilitate that. And I love to see the transformation. What differentiates banding people together from other music-based team building companies is our methodology. It's a very sound methodology built on research, experience, uh, hard knocks from the world of rock and roll in, in corporate America. And so we feel like we've done a really good job of combining the two to, to offer something that people can digest easily and put into effect very quickly. So one of my favorite things about these workshops are when people come in and they start talking about the things that are important to them at their jobs, you start to see how diverse people's perspectives are. But then there's that moment where this person is saying, hey, here's a problem I don't like, and they're sharing their perspective, and the light bulb goes off in another department where they see, oh, here's the problem. These guys see things this way, I see it this way, but they actually come together right here in the workshop and figure out, we can work around this. I get you now, I understand where you're coming from. So that's always fun. We, we get that even writing a song. So I, I love that part of the, the workshop. So organizations of, of all sizes bring us in to, to really do a great many things. In, in some cases, we're brought in for uh, to kick off a, pro a new project team launch to help establish that microculture and, and the collaborative nature on a team. In other cases, we're brought in at the beginning of leadership training when they've developed high potentials and they bring us in to help get everybody communicating and comfortable and, and vulnerable, which is the way we like it. Uh, and then in other cases, we're brought in for maybe more serious things like conflict resolution. But uh, there's a, a, lot of, a lot of things that we can do. And in some cases, it's just general, we want to have a good time and get together and get out of the office and, and get everybody thinking differently.